Hey everyone, welcome to series 24 of the Autumn Festival playlist. As usually, I'll go over the Forzaton challenge, also over the championships, what cars that I used, and here for the photo challenge. So let's first go to the weekly Forzaton. As you can see, here is the nice Formula Drift car from Ferrari and also the Hoonigan. And then we have a hat and a horn, nothing special. So let's have a look at the Fortaton. We need to own and drive the 2016 Lotus 311. We need to earn 9 stars in total on speed zones, 15 ultimate near miss skills. That was a complete waste of time, I did like 20 minutes on it, uh, 5 should be more than enough. And then we need to earn a slingshot skill. So let's have a look at the speed zone. Now the speed zone that is way the most easiest one is actually here the royal terrace why you can just start from here um if you don't want to bother too much you just roll ride it so let's have a look i put my lotus in x class so either you do it normal or you just roll ride it because it's just it's nothing important this so it doesn't really matter just drive it like this there you go just do that three times if you want to do the corner normal be my guest but i didn't really care about this one now what's the next one the 15 ultimate neo miss skills well that was a bit of a pain in the mm. you just go over the highway and then you need to pass and then you have like a pass skill awesome and then the ultimate comes so i've been driving up and down here constantly till i actually had 15 but just look good after awesome it's the ultimate and then the next one is we need a slingshot now what you need to do the best thing you can do for a slingshot is you take the drag race here uh, let's have a look i'll put it quickly on drag race where are you there you go so just take this this one um what you need to do is you need to draft behind a Dravatar and then just pass them and then you have the slingshot. It's very easy here. You have it basically instantly when you start here. So that's very, very easy to do. Just draft and then pass the Dravatar. Okay, that's it. So let's have a look at the photo challenge. What do we need to do? We need to do be in a Hoonigan and also at the rail yard so let's take a hoonigan everybody should have a hoonigan there you go it doesn't really matter which one um, just take a hoonigan you have then where do we need to go we need to go here and there you go here So everybody should know this one is a rail yard. Turn around when it is safe to do so. You just put yourself here, go in photo mode, and then you can just take a picture. Doesn't really matter. Take the pic, and then you will see on the right side uh, you have the hoonigan and also the uh, the challenge. Now this takes a little bit long, I shouldn't have actually take the picture, there you go. Okay, so that's for the photo challenge. So it's here at the rail yard, if you can see express rail yard, there you need to take the picture. Now let's go over the rest. Here at the trial, I'll go on the map. I'll put the speed zones off, the drag strip, that's always easier. Now here as you can see you need uh, for the trial, you need a B700 Ford. Now I looked for a Ford, um, I have several ones. I'll just put uh, DCB class on and then let's go to Ford. Now as you can see here's also the new car. As you can see, we have several options uh, for Ford. Uh, the car that for me is the best 
and probably will be the best is actually the Mustang Mach 1. That's the car I've used for the trial, had no problems with it. So I just taking that car, it's the best choice for the trial. Now what can we win from the trial? We win a Ford XB Falcon. That's something like this. Okay, let's go to the next one. The next one is Playgrounds. Playgrounds is actually here at the castle. A800 Super Saloons. So let's have a look at the Super Saloons. So we need A-Class and then a Super Saloon. Uh, where was it last time? I didn't find... Ah, there it is. So we have several choices in here. Um, I'm probably going to take... Let's have a look. Well, basically, I'm not sure yet what I'm going to take. Um, probably the Q50 or maybe the RS6. The M2 is also a good car. So that's basically what you prefer to take from car. Uh, we can actually win the Mercedes, the E63. This is a car that you can actually win. Okay, let's go to the next one. Up your street. So we need an S1 900 modern supercar. So let's have a look at the modern supercars. It is an S1 and it's here. This is a car that you can actually win, but I advise you if you take the Ascari, that car is really OP uh, for this championship. So, and it's not an expensive car, but this car is really good for that. Of course, there are always other cars that you can take, but it depends on your preference. But I took the Ascari like last time. What can we win from that? We win the new Ford GT70. I will show that on the end of my video. Now let's go to the next one. Hard at work. We need A800 Sports Utility. I'll show you because there are several cars that you can use. So I'll put my favorites on. Sports Utilities. There you go. Well, I'll put my favorites off. So you have a little bit of choice here. Um, I'm going to put my favorites back on. The Lambo is also a very good car. The 2019 Macan is a car that we can win, actually. Um, but the 2012 Porsche Cayenne is always be my favorite because it's actually a very good car and also a grippy car and it handles very well so i took that car for that now what can we win from that actually the macan 2019 okay let's go to the next championship the last one here we need a800 extreme off-road so let's have a look what we have so i need the a and then extreme off-road There you go. So you have several cars that you can actually use, but I always stick with my Bowler. It always works that Bowler, that car been, I don't know, I've, I have been playing this game for since a um, pre-order and that car always does the trick. It's good, it's handling good, it absorbs um, the bumps and all. And I think this one was actually cross country. Now, what do we win from that? The Ford Raptor from 2011. Now let's have a look at our PR stones. So I'll put the PR stones on. There you go. So let's have a look here at this one. I'm not sure how much meters we need or but I'll show you what you actually need to do. I actually went here in my hooligan. Now the best thing, well you always know when I do this, I probably fail, but that's okay. I'll just show you what the best things you can do. You need to get a little bit of a straight line, like this. I put my car just in fourth gear. Here I go a little bit of throttle. And there you go, just make sure that you land not against the tree, but and not against the wall, uh, uh, not against the wall, yeah, otherwise you will fail. So that's what you need to do for the good line of that. 
just start here and then just go off throttle on the little bump here then this one this is also a fun one you need to start from this side there you go now what you need to do is you need to go a little bit off-road let's hope there's no traffic coming from here you just go off-road yeah I got it there you go I almost crashed I almost missed it but that's what you need to do um, for that speed trap then let's go to the next one that's here well here it depends what you want to do you can start from actually both sides but you can cut off a little bit of the corners in this one if you have a hard time I'm not sure why my game is so laggy but so what you can do here let me see You can take the normal route. Uh, you can cut off this corner a little bit, just be careful. But if you can also just put the walls away and you will also have it. Now if you start from this side, here, you can actually cut off a little bit. There you go. And uh, wait. And here this one you can also cut off <coughs> a little bit my apologies and then you also will have it so you just need if you break the little walls here it won't slow you down anymore but you can do it from both sides I did it from both sides um, and I put the walls away and you don't have any problems So that are all the championships, this one stays the same, Mont Revivals, just take one that is very slow and then you can win it um, and online adventure just qualify once a month. Here as you can see we have at 50% the McLaren 12C and at 80% the Rossian Q1. I actually never drove that car or never tuned that car so I should try it at the end now let's have a look at the car that we won it's a Ford, the nice from the 70s there you go so this is the car that we won i'll go quickly to a road there you go and we will have a look how the car looks like so this is a brand new car that we won from this week. Let's have a look inside. Mm, that looks cool. In 400 meters, turn sharp left. Well, that car looks pretty cool. Turn sharp left. So we need to test it out. Mm. And it is a B-class car, so maybe we can keep it in B-class or maybe go to A-class, that depends. We need to tune it and then see. It is rear-wheel drive, I feel. Yeah, it's rear-wheel drive, so we need to see how it handles, but it actually handles very well. needs a little bit fine tuning but yeah it looks pretty okay well that's it for this week um i hope my car choices help you get all the cars and that you got the new car i'll be streaming the festival playlist tonight on twitch in about three hours now from now so you're all welcome if you have problems you can always join the convoy we always do the seasonal stuff with the club members so it's always easy to win Okay, thanks for watching. Hope to see you tonight. Have a, have a good day. Bye-bye.